it's Jade from Sweet Softies and I'm excited to share with you my 34 week pregnancy vlog. Um, my last one was done at 30 weeks and I have a few new updates since then. I will be going through the usual like showing you a quick look at my belly and um, sharing about my weight gain, things like that. Um, and I also want to share with you the name that we decided for our baby. Um, I'll be talking about my visit to a 3D, 4D um, ultrasound clinic from last week and some great information we learned about the baby during that time. Um, and I'll also show you some of the maternity photos that we were able to take. Um, and I was able to um, get some really affordable dresses and accessories for those shoots, uh, which I will share and link in the description box below too. All right, so um, let's get started. So um, for my quick belly update, um, I have gained uh, 20, 21 pounds since um, my since my pre-pregnancy weight, and um, I've definitely rounded out quite a bit since uh, 30 weeks um, when I last uh, did a vlog. With the size and the weight, um, I've found that some tasks that were easy for me at 30 weeks have now become more of a struggle. Sitting down on the floor and getting up from where I was sitting on the floor was not as easy as it was uh, four weeks ago. So um, there's that and I still have a good six weeks left of my um, pregnancy, possibly more depending on when baby wants to come. Um, so. I am not quite sure how this is all going to roll out, but in my next update, I will let you know. So for our baby's name, we decided to go with the name Lena Rose. Um, Lena means light in Greek. We thought that would be fitting for our July baby. And it also means kind and generous in Arabic languages. My husband really... Um, liked that name as we went down a list and it was also another one that I loved. Um, I did originally want to wanted to go with the name Luna Rose for my daughter because um, it's inspired by an Italian song which is Luna Rosa meaning the red moon and um, I had gotten that idea because my sister's name, Sorrento, um, is after an Italian song as well. That's kind of originally where I got the inspiration from, but I'm so happy with the name Lena because it's um, a first name that my husband and I both really like, and it is phonetically similar to my original um, preference. So it worked out quite well for us. So my husband and I also went to a 3D, 4D um, ultrasound clinic last week at 33 weeks. And um, it was really great because we got to see our little girl and what she looks like, um, get kind of a sneak peek of her. And unfortunately, um, she was quite sleepy during that visit and she had her hands covered with her face <laughs> pretty much the whole time. So we didn't get any clear um, views of her face, but we did get some great information about her um, um, in other aspects. So we did find out that she takes after my husband quite a bit. She's quite a long and uh, slender baby. Um, which surprised me because I've been short and stout from birth till now and I expected a short and stout baby. Um, anyhow, she's quite long, quite slender, has these long wrists, long legs, long arms, and um, long fingers as well. And her um, hair seems to be quite lengthy and thick as we found out. So that's really kind of interesting. As for our maternity shoot, my husband and I did a DIY sort of shoot um, because with the whole pandemic thing going on right now, 
uh, we are having to shelter in place and socially distance so this is our alternative to um, a typical maternity shoot and I feel quite fortunate to still be able to have this experience and um, I was able to get some really affordable dresses off Amazon as well as some flower crowns a couple actually I got a pink one and a white one and um, it was all so much cheaper than if I were to get it off um, a dedicated like maternity website um, or or somewhere like Etsy for um, those beautifully handmade flower crowns. So if you're on a budget like me, um, I definitely recommend checking out um, the links below. Um, I'll link those products so that you can uh, take a look at them as well. Um, so yeah, there's that.